Chuan Nelson Hill again from Austin, Texas, visiting the uh, Hongbu Dojo in Valencia. I wanted to ask uh, Shiroshi Luis uh, to talk a little bit more about Kumo Bito. I heard about these techniques being involved from the Kumo Rasen. Right. Could you come into a little bit more detail as to how that works? Okay. <coughs> Kumo Bito is the, the ancient way of body combat that the season used to employ. Huh. Uh, the Kumo Bito is like uh, the real Jiu Jitsu from the season tradition. You know, the Kumo Gasen are the spiral battle that the, from the feudal era the Japanese used to some masters to, to come to some kind of fight between several spiders and the spiders fight. The season take uh, look around what uh, the, the nature was giving to them. And they see that the spider became in their battle very, very close circumstance. They used to enroll, get entwined with the enemy, and they see that the like the limbs could be entwined, getting rolled one against the other, and this become became a very, very close combat situation, and very controlled. Then the the people was surprised by this kind of action right. then. Uh, the origin of that, uh, of that study is, is this, is the way for, 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 uh, for fighting like spiders. Then Kumo Bito is like a man like a spider, fighting like a spider. Uh -huh. uh, one of the most interesting characteristics that don't know many people because Kumo Ito is a very, 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 uh, it's very kept, it's kept in secrecy. It's a very secret side of our tradition as all our season links or all season uh, studies are very well kept and only reserved for the high degree uh, studies. But there are, inside Kumo Ito we have also several methods inside that could be employed in this kind of uh, body combat, this close quarter combat. I would like to introduce you, because you are here in Valencia, you are training, you are trying to uh, investigate, to, to study in deep or tradition, and we will, I will explain you what is about Onigumo. And I will take this opportunity also to show to all our subscribers and followers on YouTube channel in order to understand a little more about this special method. Oni Gumo Oni comes from demon and Gumo, it's like a Kumo in Kumo Vito that means spiral. It's like the demon of the spiral. It's a special method uh, that covers the Kumo Vito and it's covering um, goes about to rest uh, make restriction on the limbs and when they fall they drop their body downward the limbs are completely uh, on a joint lock then it's a very very explicit way of breaking joints bones etc mm -hmm. and it's very very damaging it's well focused on war situation on real when you are dealing with a life or death situation, then uh, I think that the best way, because of course we are uh, speaking about, we are uh, introducing, but we are not explaining how they became to, to this, this way of thinking and arrive to that violent, joint locks, violent situation. Okay? Then uh, I think that the best way is that uh, taking as we have here uh, Sensei Rebecca, as we've used her in order to do it carefully, slowly, only for didactical purpose, in order to, to be clear also to the, to the camera and for you. Passion. Only more. Okay, uh, let's see from the basics and let's go to more advantage situations because this is a wide study that you need to take several classes you need to improve and then many masters give their own perspective 
then it's a wide method that you have to, this is not based on 10, 15 sequences, it's a wide method that you could go in different angles and different approaches. Okay, first of all, let's go to the practice and I will give you details after that. For example, in a um, situation like that we are in Renkaku, we are in fighting in a closed situation here. What I will do, of course, she is not trying to attack me right now, only for didactical purpose itself. I will move here to the side, pretty good to see, but the idea is that we will restrain the leg, the leg of Sensei Rebecca here, but when we are going down to the ground, we need to go very fast and with a very smooth and uh, simple movement to an ending uh, technique. I will also, the other side please. From here, I go to the side, take the leg here, sorry, and from here it's very important to do the following. I pass here, very fast, and from here I go down. Because here the leg is a stretch, it's a joint lock here. From here, of course, we could restrain having this both mm -hmm. here. And for here, I will move aside, maybe rolling, and this, who you see, it's right. very hard, and this will break in all points that we have deal with. We have the restriction on the knee mm -hmm. and the restriction on the elbow, both are here, and this, when we roll, it's a way of breaking in several points. From that situation, we could cover a lot of circumstances. For example, it's usually employed when the, your, the opponent is trying to attack me with a kick, like my ship team. One, I am doing it slowly, one is covering and the other is striking. In order to gain this kind of control. From here, we will be capable of entering in circumstances to have control. And when I throw to the ground, we have the following. Take a look here. This is break here. Right. And we could restrain this. And when we move, we are breaking again. We have the control here. Right. And we are breaking the ankle. Can you see? And this with a drop movement or a rolling movement. This is the idea of Onigumo. We have very interesting principles here, also with Maya Shinji, for example. Go here, we have this control, and we have this. In order, going down, this breaks, and of course, taking this, also with the legs, I could move here and right now break here we have the control on the right knee and the pressure breaking here on this side and we have the roll and rotation in order to break of course this is a basic idea when she is on the ground and we are following like in Kumo Bito order but Onigumo extends to the taxi position in a very, very nice circumstances. For example, please. The idea is when we drop the body to the ground to perform violent ways of throwing the enemy. I will show you several proposals on this, on this idea. For example, if we go to that position, a very Typical, please, only here on Jujutsu. What we will do is to modify, to switch my body. In order, when we are here, take a look, we have this control. My elbow goes directly to the clavicular area. Mm -hmm. And here, I will draw my body to the ground, leading my knee upward. And here, breaks here. At the same time, I am pressing with the elbow downward in order to break the shoulder, especially the clavicula. 
and here. Of course, we yes. could fall and also break into this point, also Shoulder. having this control turning. Why I am doing here? Because a very characteristic side on Onigumo, it's always when you are dealing with the hands, you must cross them. You must unite them. Make a class. Yeah, you have here in order. You cannot do something like that. This right. is not this is not only humo okay. because this is not characteristic. This is why you need to learn, especially from a master, because maybe you see and and it's uh, uh, and it's uncharacteristic if you try to do by your way. Also, other characteristics of Onigumo is you have to cross the, the you have to cross the arms or crossing the legs. You have several ideas here. I will explain after regarding these studies. Very, very interesting side here. For example, when we are on Venkaku situation, I will do the following. For example, I will go here and I will make this kind of, uh, of control. Mm -hmm. In order, when he is falling, for example, here to the ground, maybe stepping and falling forward, this is breaking to the other side. We could do it in the other circumstance. For example, when we try to grab on this idea. Hi. Here, or more correctly, sorry, here. Can you see? Hi. We could move forward and when we go backward, back. Yeah. We have this control. This was very special movements, controls, in order to break to this side, please. When she's trying to grab me, they used to employ this opening and from here going to the side. Hi. And I, I will do very, very slowly. Sure. Please be sitting down, okay? This will be from the position of she being sta uh, standing. standing up. Yeah. But from here, the idea is to fall oh, in that side on both of them. Hi. This is what I mean with dropping techniques. Right. You can do whatever also in, in Cairo situations. Mm -hmm. I mean, when she is trying to tag me, maybe from Kaiyo Toshi, please. Take a look here. She's trying to do Kaiyo Toshi. I will stop and I will cross the legs, as I have explained you. From here, we could go to the ground, falling, and at the same time, I will move in order to break here. Can you see? Hi. Here, I'm breaking. Also, there are thousands of ways of applying this method, crossing, etc. Okay. Then, this is the application basic for this road method that covers what is called Onibuno, the, the spider beam of right. Link to the Kumuito tradition, the Kumuito legacy from our from our school. Do you have any question, Nikolai? No, so from mm -hmm. what I've understood, it's either the clasping of the hands or the crossing of the legs, followed by a rolling of the body, taking the person down, using momentum and breaking the joint. And dropping yes. at the same time. Could you, would you like maybe to do slowly with our together yes. in order to feel a little yes. about that please okay here hey you break But I won't Hi. let you go. Yes. Then we have this kind of, of control, this kind of leverage, Hi. maybe grabbing your head, mm -hmm. and this will be very, very hard to, 
to fall and of course have the goal of compression to break completely. Right. It's important to feel because uh, something is to uh, to watch from outside. Yeah, yes. But since that maybe uh, you have conditions to defend, to escape, to run away. But in this case, when you are so close, the body it's completely um, trapped yeah. by the other. Uh, it's very difficult on these kind of rolls, these kind of drops to 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 escape from. Okay, uh, thank you very much. I hope you have enjoyed and see you on, on next time. Thank you.